All right, welcome to Rapid Updates, another Iraq update, hopefully in less than five minutes. Today's Tuesday, September 13th. And just a little reminder for all you new people, this is Rapid News. More news, less BS, so you can focus on what really matters, and that is preparing for the environment ahead, controlling what you can control. Let's get rapid. Yes, it's good to be back. I'm glad to be back in the saddle here, bringing you some news on Iraq and other news you we all love to stay updated on. Let's start out with, will the government use Kuwait's money to pay contract dues? So the technical advisor to the Prime Minister, Al Jabari, is talking about the surplus of money that they have to pay dues, contracts that are out, including Kuwait's debts. Apparently, even though we paid off, we Iraq has paid off Kuwait. There's still some sidelining contracts and debts they have to pay to Kuwait. And Jabari wants to pass uh, saying that it's possible to use the surplus funds to, to pay Kuwait's debts and other contracts that are out. But what's really worth mentioning in this short article is at the very end, Iraq expects its cash reserves of hard currencies to reach $100 billion, an amount that has not been achieved in all of its history in Iraq. Therefore, it must invest in development. That's what I wanted to share with you is that statement, $100 billion of hard currency that Iraq for the first time in history. And yes, it must be used to invest back into the country. That's what I wanted to share with you. Also, Maliki is making some statements that is heating up the opposition. He issued this statement on Tuesday about insulting the competitors companions of the prophet he says every website is exposed in my name to insult slander and abuse of the companion and the wives of the prophet i declare my innocent of it the circulation of logic and insult cursing is a plan to entrap muslims and stir up hateful sectarian strife at the time when the enemies are rallying against the islamic nation it's heating up folks there's probably going to be another protest very soon let me get to that iraq government Government. They are beefing up on security. They await the return of protesters after ignoring Al Sadr's warnings. Despite the warnings of the return of the Sadr's movements, demonstrations, similar to what happened in August, the coordination framework is proceeding to project to form a new government and hold a session of the Iraqi parliament next week. It seems that the CF has taken the decision not to pay any att attention to any reservations by Al Sadr. I mean, didn't Al Sadr just quit politics? They're actually moving forward and setting a date for the Iraqi parliament session to elect a president of the republic and then assigning the candidate for prime minister, Al Sudani. It's been reported and revealed that there is a preliminary agreement between the presidency of the parliament and the political blocs to resume holding legislative sessions at the end of the 14th of this week. Iraqi security forces redeployed in the vicinity of Iraqi parliament building increased a number of concrete blocks near the place and began erecting a huge iron door in the middle of the, uh, I'm going to mispronounce this, the Jumharia Bridge leading to the Green Zone with the aim of closing it at any time, apparently to prevent demonstrators from heading to Parliament in case the session was held. I read this long article and really it just talks again, what's going on, what does the coordination framework want, they want the prime minister in, then form the government where the allies of the Satyrs movement, the KDP, and then the Sunnis and those other alliances, they want to, they agree with early elections, but they don't want that prime minister involved. It's back and forth. It's really, in my opinion, at this time, it's heating up for another demonstration. Are you ready? Is Iraq ready? There are other people like Nader who's talked about these demonstrations. They're just not happening once. They come in waves. So they're regrouping possibly. I don't know. You tell me in the comments below. Until the next Rapid Updates video, stay rapid.